हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू साइंस क्लास टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू द क्वेश्चन एंड एंसर्स सो क्लास सेवन दिस इज योर क्वेश्चन एंड एंसर्स फॉर चैप्टर वन विच वी हैव जस्ट कम्प्लीटेड चैप्टर वन न्यूट्रिशन इन प्लांट्स दीज आर द क्वेश्चन विच यू हैव टू डू इन कॉपी सी देर आर थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ क्वेश्चन गिवेन द फर्स्ट वन इज वेरी शॉर्ट विच टेल्स विच आस्क answers in just one or two sentences the next type is answer in detail and the last one is think and answer in this segment we will be doing the questions and answers for question number e that is answer the following questions in one or two sentences so the first question asks differentiate between autotrophic and heterotrophic mode of nutrition so autotrophic and heterotrophic divide the page into two parts the first point they can make their own food heterotrophic they depend on autotrophs or other heterotrophs they have chlorophyll they may or may not have chlorophyll example all green plants example pitcher pitcher plant mushroom etc second question why does a pitcher plant eat insects when it is capable of carrying out photosynthesis pitcher plant eat insect because this plant grow in the soil which is nitrogen deficient to fulfill their nitrogenous demand they trap insects despite being capable to photosynthesize third question how does a dodder plant obtain its food as we know dodder plant is a parasitic plant the dodder plant has no green leaves to photosynthesize its stem twin around the host producing suckers called hostoria hostoria invade the host and steal its food fourth question asks what chemical reaction takes place in the process of photosynthesis so the following chemical reaction takes place in the process of photosynthesis and the reaction is 6CO2 plus 6H2O in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll gives C6H12O6 plus 6O2. Carbon dioxide plus water in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll gives glucose and oxygen. Fifth question asks, how do saprophytic plant digest its food? Saprophytic plant digest its food by releasing digestive enzymes on decaying matter. the enzymes break down the solid complex matter into simple matter in a liquid form then the nutrients present in the liquid are absorbed by this plant so this is how your very short questions and answers gets completed in the next segment we will be doing the question and answers in detail till then write all these questions and answers in your copy try to understand each and every topic and learn it i have attached the pdf of this question and answers in the description box you can download it from there also and that will help you in writing till then take care goodbye